Okay, so I'm going to go through the scatter graph homework that I've set the year eight. So initially, the first question, it says 10 students were asked how much time they spend on the computer each week and then were timed running the 100 metres, the results are listed here. The first five results have been plotted for you. So we've got 11.3 and then 8, 13, 13 and so on. So we're going to plot these next five points. So we're going to go along the corridor and then up the stairs. So 15.8 will be somewhere here and then up to 16. 15.8, 16. Now as long as you hold it and you're within maybe half a square, it will um, it will just pin it to the right location. So uh, 12.6, just over there, and 6. Okay, 12.2 and 10, 14.5 and 14, and 11.5 and 5. Okay. Now, because we've got that particular uh, format, okay, we've plotted the five points. We're now going to look to click hit to draw or store the line. So again, we're going to click on the very first, and we'll draw the line somewhere in there. Okay. And then estimate the 100 meter time for a student who spent 15 hours a week on a computer. So hours on a computer, we would follow the line of 15 just about here, across, and then we're going to come down. So 15.5 would be just above. So we're going to go 15. Point Three. 15.3, 15.4, somewhere there. So we'll say 15.3. Does the graph show a positive or negative correlation? Well, positive goes up. This graph does go up. So we're going to say it shows a positive correlation. Click mark it. Okay, and then we've got all those correct. The key thing with the line of best fit is make sure it starts on the very first point uh, and then we've got as much as we can equidistant between all the points. Okay. Second question, again plotting five points so we we'll quickly do that, 47, 45, 46, 47 and then up to 9, 47, 46, 47. We've got 48, 12, so slightly further across, and 12. Okay. We've got 51, 7. We've got 56 and 4. And then we've got 59 and 3. Now as you can see, we have created the, uh, oops, 3 is going to be 59 and 3. So we've applied our points, we're going to draw, do the same thing with the line of best fit, so I'm going to click on that very top cross, and now this time we're going to try and draw through all of those, so we'll get on that line there. Okay. Estimate to the nearest whole number the weekly hours of sport for a student who runs 10 kilometers in 45 minutes. So time to run 45 minutes. How's the player for sport? Okay, coming up here, 45 minutes. So roughly is gonna be 10 hours to the nearest whole number. Does the graph show positive or negative correlation? Remember positives going up negatives coming down so this shows a negative correlation and then again click market always click see your summary 
and then click finish and close.